swear we're professionals. All right, guys, <laughs> welcome back to the second episode of Dried Blood. We definitely did not record this without the audio just a minute ago. So uh, this is the first time we're having this conversation. Yeah, man, part two. Welcome back to episode two of Dried Blood, uh, Grandmaster. <laughs> Hello and welcome back and thank you all for joining us. I, okay, I've had a chance now to take in what we just saw and I'm still, I'm just still in shock at the talent that we had tonight showed with the RPs and top it all off the Nat 20s, which don't get me wrong, Nat 20s always make me freak out. But now that I continue to think about it, Nat 20s are, I mean, again, it's just another number, but what makes them amazing and what makes even the Nat 1s make you catch your breath is how everyone responds. And that's what we saw every single time there was hope in every single dice roll that was made there. And we saw dreams made and crushed on the battlefield. So I want to throw it to our wonderful champions who fought tonight just ever so fiercely, tooth and nail into the very last final breath until we disappeared into the lava. Did you put everything out there on the battlefield? Are you proud of what you did? Adam, we'll start with you. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> it was, like you said, I, I mean, I felt like the, the, the cards were stacked against me most of the <laughs> night because I was, I mean, I created a character that was going to be anta antagonistic to like everyone, like just in how he performs, right? Low Maybe. intelligent magician. Um, but no, I mean, it was, you know, for me, Cone of Cold was like the the epic conclusion spell that I had, right? Because mm -hmm. I know uh, Miss Magitek or Tracy, you know, she she created Amran, which is all about fire. So I thought, you know, what what's not better to fight fire than ice? So I, I, I actually love how everything ended. I think that the 20s at the end back and forth were just <laughs> insane. Okay. So I, I was incredibly happy. Agreed. That was like a complete volley back and forth, back and forth. <laughs> it really response, was. Answered, response, answer. Just insane energy that stacked. And it yep. was teetering on like that final game of Jenga and there's one piece left and it's <laughs> so nervous. And of course, Miss Magitek, you had to pull that final piece. But before it all came crumbling down, tell me about your performance. Did you love it? What was your big moment that you're like, yes, I own this. I love this. Yeah, I, I got I was also, yeah, very proud of first of all, I was very proud that I rolled that Nat 20 uh when you used Cone of Cold because it just gave me that reason it gave Amron that reason to think that fire will always be better than cold or and and everything like that. So uh it, it made me feel good in that moment. But to a fault, she's a very cocky person and she just had that hubris mm -hmm. and um it it was a fault to her, so she just thought she could just take it, and it did. It helped that Adam or was playing Magic, who was a character that's very uh, not doesn't seem the brightest, and and you know it, to her seems like a fool. So she just thinks she could take him out very easily. But clearly, he had a lot of tricks up his sleeve that she was not prepared for. Um, I was saying that I I should have I should have used my immolation again. And that's my one regret. I probably could have finished you off oh, if, yeah. I had, if I had just done, if I had just like given you all I got in that last attack. But it was a very fitting way to go, I feel, uh, for Amarin to become one with the lava of this arena. Yes. So I, I, I'm like, I'm actually okay with her her death in a way. So I thought that was really good. <laughs> it was so majestic. Like there is yeah. nothing more poetic. Yep. Then Amran, this fire goddess who entered mm -hmm. the field full of rage and intensity, fire yep. and eyes and hair and everywhere, mm -hmm. just to be swallowed whole by the flame itself. The real Terminator yep. 2 vibes. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. The, 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 that's immediately what I thought. Yeah, that's immediately yes. what I thought. I literally I, sank I down like, my chair. Yep. When, when you started describing the, the lava, I was like, of course it's fire. Of course it's fire. Yeah. Like, of yeah. course, like, and then like I saw her roll poorly and I was like, I couldn't remember if she was immune or not. And I was like, I guess we're going another round if if I make it. Yeah. And I made my save and then it was, you know, the, the outcome. But like, I just think it was the 20s back and forth and like saving against each other. And then mm -hmm. having the 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 crowd and the, that chaos event come in, I, it was just, oh. I mean, that ended like picture perfect and in that my was mind. that was yeah. crazy because like you guys went back and forth to the 20s which was nuts by itself but then like uh you know chat they really wanted that last chaos event they were just like tossing subs and tossing like everything to get there it's just like we mm -hmm. want it we want it and it worked out so good 
I uh, I want to I want to talk about though for a second, and, and you can say no, Adam, but uh, Magic has a has a secret that we didn't see in the episode. Oh yeah. Do you want to share Magic's secret in the after hours? Uh, oh, I mean, I kind of do, but uh, you know, I don't know if there's going to be a, a return of Magic ever. Totally so up to you. I'm going to hold the secret mm. for now, okay. just in case. But if that doesn't happen, then I will be happy to come back or let you guys <laughs> uh, tell everyone about it. Yeah, but it's it, pretty awesome. <laughs> leave it to Adam to have some little other secret thing <laughs> that his character has that. <laughs> That's okay, secret, you're, you're the one that had the, like, strength before yeah. death or whatever. I didn't see that coming. Yeah. I'm like, of course she does. Like, of course she can save it. <laughs> strength in the grave. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's yep. a, I was that was a perfect one. I I think I had read that you had that, and I did, but I had forgotten about it. So when you said, mm -hmm. "Oh, I'm using strength in the grave," I was like, "Oh shit!" Yes. I, thought, I thought you were going to immolate him again. The DC and you lowered the DC. I was like, "Of course he lowers well, the DC." Of course I mean, he the DC. <laughs> to be fair, to be fair, it was like high. It was like 46 yeah. points of damage. So half yeah. of that's 23 plus five. It's a 28. It would have been like, yeah, yeah. That's no, no, no. Which I, I, I wasn't upset. Like yeah, like a twenty-five. Yeah, a twenty-five. Yeah, or, yeah. Oh I'm like, I just was like, your spell save sixteen. I'll make it too too better than that. That sounds fair. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. No, it was it was fine. <laughs> yep. All right. Well, any any well, either one of you, but especially uh, our champion. Any any last words from either Magic or Amrin to the to the fans? Any any parting wisdom? Stay away from creepy dolls. Uh, well, actually, don't stay away from creepy dolls because that creepy doll helped Magic. Hey. So don't judge a creepy doll by its cover, apparently. That's that's <laughs> what I've learned from this. Uh, but maybe now Magic has some weird pact that he made. Like, because he got that symbol on his hand now. So I'm just like, he probably is in some secret pact with some devil or something. It's <laughs> a devil doll cult. Yeah, yeah, devil exactly. So, yeah. Good luck with that, Magic called cult of the dollywood okay thanks uh anyway uh uh no i i uh just had a had a blast i hope you guys enjoyed uh magic and uh amarin i mean it was it was a lot of fun the entire environment everything was was freaking awesome uh you know and i just want to say that uh you know i always am a performer so uh if you want you can reach out to jerry my manager and he can uh, he can get you into a city near you i've done never went to i've done boulders gate i've done water deep you know i can go up and down the sword coast all right thank you very much from your champion uh uh magic the magician the majesty the majestic i'll stop now sorry that's perfect <laughs> beautiful but no better way to end it we'll see you next time guys Ha, <laughs> ha,